Indian CEOs who are leading today world tech giants. Hey guys, welcome to our channel Tech Zone. Indians are excelling in almost every field, including the technical ones. They are now leading some of the most significant ventures. Who are they? And what did they accomplish? Let us cover all of it in today's video. Google and Alphabet Incorporated CEOs, Sundar Pichai, 49 years old. After completing his research in the United States, Sundar Pichai enrolled in generational discipline and began running for Google in 2004. During his time at Google, he became so well-known that he was promptly recruited to join Microsoft as CEOs. Sundar Pichai graduated from the Indian Institute of Technology in Kharagpur, India, with a bachelor's degree in metallurgy. He subsequently went to Stanford University in California, where he got a master's degree in materials science and engineering. Following that, he earned an MBA from the University of Pennsylvania's Wharton School of Business. After being born in Madras, India, he traveled to the United States for his master's and became a naturalized citizen after being born in Madras, India. According to Man's World India magazine, Almost all Sundar testimonies depict him as an attentive, courteous, and humble man with exceptional zeal and motivation for Google. Engineers love it, wrote Google's software program engineer right away. He is adored by the product manager and is also loved by the business people. Glassdoor's 98% approval, according to a Business Insider editorial. Because of his unique features and near Google determination, he was dubbed one of Glassdoor's top CEOs in 2016. Ricefield Twitter CEO Parag Agrawal, 37 years old. After working as a student intern at Microsoft, Yahoo, and AT&T Laboratories, Parag Agrawal joined Twitter in 2011. Peril Agrawal is an early companion and alumni of Bollywood's famous playback, vocalist Drea Goshal. Parag earned a bachelor's degree in computer science and engineering from the Indian Institute of Technology in Kharagpur, India. He earned a PhD in computer science from Stanford University in California. He was born in the Indian city of Ajmer in the state of Rajasthan. He moved to the United States to get his doctorate. He also became a citizen of the United States. Parag started here as an engineer who was highly interested in our images and is now our CEO of Dorsey, who co-founded Twitter in 2006, wrote, According to CNBC, his engineering performance had improved the target market development on Twitter and has become famous with agencies long before he joined Dorsey. Dorsey tweeted after they selected him as CEO of Twitter. Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella, 54 years old. Satya Nadella worked at Sun Microsystems before joining Microsoft in 1992. He is married to his classmate and has worked for Microsoft for over three years. His wife, Microsoft, and cricket are his three loves. He enjoys cricket. He graduated from Manipal Institute of Technology in Karnataka, India, with a bachelor's degree in electrical engineering. He went to the University of Wisconsin, Milwaukee, to get his master's degree in computer science. After that, he went to the University of Chicago Booth Business School in the United States to get his MBA. He was born in Hyderabad, now in the Indian state of Telangana. He relocated to the United States to watch his master and ultimately became a U.S. citizen. If you don't jump on anything new, you won't survive, he said right away. His improved performance at Microsoft demonstrates his resolve. Education, migration, and willpower were so groundbreaking for him that he now receives a yearly baseline revenue of $918,917, plus a coin bonus of $3,600,000 and a perk of $12,729. Adobe CEO Shantan Narian, 58 years old. In 1998, a man who aspired to be a journalist since he was a child joined Adobe as vice president and trendy manager of his generation group engineering. Before that, he worked at Pictra Incorporated, an Apple-owned company. He graduated from Osmania University in Hyderabad, India, with a bachelor's degree in electronic communication technology. He went on to receive a master's degree in computer science from Bowling Green State University in Ohio and an MBA from the University of California, Berkeley's Haas School of Business. According to his bio, he was born in Hyderabad, 
Telangana, India. He traveled to the United States after getting his bachelor's degree to pursue his master's degree. IBM CEO's Arvind Krishna, 59 years old. He is the co-author of 15 patents and the frontline architect of IBM's $34 billion purchase of Red Hat in 1990. He was the driving force behind IBM's more cutting-edge technology, including artificial intelligence, cloud computing, and quantum computing. He was born in the year Andhra Pradesh is a state in India. He graduated from the Indian Institute of Technology in Kanpur, India, with a bachelor's degree in electrical engineering. He earned his doctorate. He graduated from the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign with a PhD in electrical engineering. He moved to the United States to get his doctorate. He also became a citizen of the United States. I was highly motivated by a talented and devoted crew. All of these billionaires are indeed inspiring for the young generation. Have we missed out on any essential names in today's video? Let us know in the comment section below and subscribe to our channel.